busy day. And I can show you how to make a Merbius strip. First of all, you need to get a strip of paper just like this. Now, a normal piece of paper has two sides, the front and the back. But if I give this strip of paper a twist and then join the ends together, I've created a Merbius strip. Now, a Merbius strip doesn't have a front and a back like a regular piece of paper or an inside and outside like you'd find in an ordinary loop. Let me prove it. If I get a pen and draw a line down the centre of the strip all the way around until I reach the point I started from, you can see that the Merbius strip only has one side. And what's more, by following the line, I end up going twice around the loop before I reach the point I started from. And that's not the strangest thing about a Merbius strip. If you started to walk around this loop of paper, holding a pen in your right hand, by the time you got halfway around the Merbius strip, you'd find that you were holding the pen in your left hand instead. Walking around the Merbius strip would turn you into a mirror image of yourself. But something even weirder has happened to me. When I opened the front door this morning, all I could see was a dense, terrifying blackness that seemed to stretch to infinity. I don't know where my mum, dad and sister Lily have gone. I'm not even sure what's real anymore. But I'm going to find out.